Welcome to Nadia's Kitchen Creations. This week I'm making a healthier peanut butter cookie. So you'll need one cup of natural peanut butter, smooth or crunchy, a pinch of salt, one teaspoon of baking powder or quarter teaspoon of baking soda, a couple shavings of fresh nutmeg, an eighth teaspoon of cinnamon, one whole large egg, half a cup of dates, and you can add about quarter cup of hot water and process it in a blender. I went ahead and just chopped up the dates, added, added the hot water and left them to soak overnight in the fridge and then I just mashed it with a fork. I also used a quarter cup of toasted shaved coconut and a quarter cup of sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds. I used half a cup mixed of dark chocolate chips and milk chocolate chips. Mix the dates and the peanut butter, adding the remaining ingredients and mix until everything is incorporated well, about 30 seconds really doesn't make that much of a big deal in which order you add everything in. Can't really over mix it. It will get thicker once you add the egg in to the peanut butter or you can just go ahead and mix the dry ingredients first and then add it to the wet and you'll place it on your prepared baking sheet. Bake these at 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 177 degrees Celsius and they take depending on your oven between 12 to 15 minutes maybe longer. For me I know that they're cooked when they start to kind of crack on the outside or if you just very lightly press the cookies let them cool on the baking sheet for about two to three minutes and then remove them onto a wire rack to cool completely of course you can enjoy these warm or store them in an airtight container you can freeze them for up to about two months thank you for tuning into this episode of Nadia's Kitchen Creations if you have any comments questions or concerns please drop them in the comment section you can head on over to maplepoints.com for the full and printable recipe and don't forget to subscribe subscribe and click that notification button so you know when I upload a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.